Hi, Judy from Witch Peace Craft. Welcome to today's video. It's a wrap. No, I'm not wrapping up the channel. It's about making shawls and wraps. I have finished the two, the customer order, and I've actually made two for her to choose one from. And um, we'll see what you think. So first off the rank, I had this lady at the last charity market ask me if I could make a wrap come shawl in black colors or black variegated but mainly black I told her at the time I had some yarn that was white gray black and she thought that might be okay so I came home and I found the Hobie Twister it's got a color number two I should have looked up the color it's 55% cotton and 45% acrylic and it recommends a three to four millimeter, 3.5 to four millimeter crochet hook. Well, I actually used a 3.5. Now, this lady's had a wrap or shawl off me before in the two weight cotton, because it is a two weight or a very light cotton. And um, she loves it, except it's pink. It's red to variegated to pink to almost white, but she wants this black look. So, I made a shawl and wrap for her. I chose the YouTube tutorial by Siren's Crochet. I've made this before. It's a popular design. It's so easy to make and she does a good job of the tutorial. And if I don't understand her accent, you can always read the captions below as I have it on, the subtitles on. So here is the first shawl I have made for my valuable customer. It is the Simple Elegant Shawl for Beginners by Siren's Crochet. It's actually turned out quite big with the Hobie and there's not a lot of black. I did con colour control. There was a lot of white to start with and I thought I'm going to stop there. But I do like it. I like the edging. I love these um, lightweight shawls to have a lovely elegant edging. The yarn itself is beautiful and soft. Hobie Twister is a dream to work with. I really like it and I like the shawl. Now I know I can't remember which pattern I made the pink one in but I have a feeling that was a bag o day tutorial and a different one to what I'm about to show you. So my second shawl because I kept thinking it's not black enough I decided I'd look in my yarn stock and I found I had Linkcraft Cake Illusion Cotton. This has been discontinued. It's another two weight, 75% cotton, 25% polyester. The twister had 800 meters in it. This has got 600 and they recommend a 3.25 knitting needle. So I guess that's crochet hook too. It was 150 grams. I've used these before. I really like them. I can know why they were discontinued because it's like four strands of cotton that you're crocheting with. But I had that great tip where you feed them through a bead and there was always a bead sliding up and down them to keep them together. But yes, I do like this. It's unfortunate. I've just used my last cake. It's discontinued. Won't be a moment. Just waited for background noise to go away. So I made the Bag O' Day tutorial and it is my favourite. I don't think I, I have another favourite shawl in crochet as much as I like this one. It is called the Sweet Cherry Wine and here it is. It's much smaller mainly because I had to control the Illusion Cotton. This particular cake had a lot of knots in it and I like mine on the end. But there you have it. It's not black, it's grey to black. And this is the one I think she liked and bought before in the red. But there, I made that one. I really do like this tutorial. It's so easy, both of them are like two to three row repeat. I can't remember. This one has a pico edge. I really like the edging. I think it gives these lightweight shawls a real elegant touch to them. Now, I'm hoping she likes this one, but I'm a little worried it might be too small. But anyway, that will be her choice. If she doesn't buy them, 
they will sell. People in the tropics love these lightweight shawls, especially the variegated colours. As long as they're sort of elegant and attractive, and I think these both these patterns are, both these tutorials are excellently done. And they'll be in the li links to these tutorials in the description below. But yes, I do believe the cherry wine is my favourite. So, what else have I put down here? So for that one, I used a 3.5 millimeter crochet hook as well. And it's not as easy to work with as a twister and it's not as soft, but it is a beautiful cotton. Unfortunately, it discontinued. Crystal has a video out about three weeks ago listing her 10 easy shawls for beginners. If you really want some great tutorials and easy shawls or wraps to make, check out that link. I'm going to put that in the description below. I watched a little video today. I missed her live auction, but she raised money for her community, the police who are helping the disadvantaged in their area. And she did a presentation of a check to them today. It blows me away how much money she can raise. And she's such a kind hearted, generous person, you know, her and Eric. So make sure you check that out because I'm going to put that in the description below. It will make you feel good. It will give you a nice feeling around Christmas. There are still some very kind people out there. And yeah, well done to Crystal and her subscribers and her family for raising the money. So my charity market will be Sunday. Um, I don't know if it'll be as successful. It's still another gray area for me, but I am looking forward to it. I've been busy working, but <laughs> I've also been on the tea towel top of production line, trying to get enough of those made. But anyway, guys, until next time, make sure you check out the links for the shawls, all of them. You won't be disappointed if you make one of them. Stay safe. Stay well. Me, I'm about to go out and help clean up the yard. We have a big cyclone brewing off the coast and we have to be prepared for it because it's rumoured to be crossing land between north of here and south of here and it's just as likely to be here. So, bye for now. Thank you.